By January 1st next year in Ontario, smoking and drinking anywhere the public is normally invited or permitted, like bar patios, sporting areas, beaches and playgrounds, will be banned. We asked smokers at Jack's Cantina's patio in Niagara Falls how they feel about this ban. Basically what it comes down to is that private property is private property. Only parts should be able to dictate their own rules. The government should not have a say in my life. And I should be able to smoke. All property designated that I'm not That's it. The downside of it is the social aspect. Smoking totally goes out the wall. It's really annoying. Mass aspect. Look, I'm out here in the snowstorm smoking cigarettes. Why should I be doing this? And I love the fact that there's no smoking. Why? Because now I don't have to go home and shower so my whole room doesn't smell like cigarettes. It's beautiful. It's amazing. My biggest problem with the smoking ban, if you're going to sell the cigarettes, why on earth would you go out of your way to make it impossible for people to smoke them? That's, that's problem number one. Number two, I have never in my whole life come across anyone who had a problem with me smoking outside. Have I come across people who have problems with me smoking at the dinner table? Absolutely. That being said, if you don't want us to smoke, don't sell them. You know what? Then we're going to keep smoking. Don't Leave us alone. That's all we need to know. Smoking on patios should be allowed. So and if you don't agree, uh, what the f Wait, that's a serious thing. Okay. Do you actually think I'm going to come to the f here when I can't smoke on the f? It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. So all I have to say is, okay, smoke. Here's the 